Today we have the opportunity to speak with Kenenisa Bekele here on his hotel in Addis Abeba. We spoke about his past, his present, but above all his future in marathon. Let's take a look. We meet you at the end of the year 2014, who was crucial for you. The marathon debut with two marathons, Paris and Chicago, run at very high level. What is your opinion about this year? Uh, this year was, you know, like for me, it's uh, like learning how to run marathon. It's like uh, studying, you know, uh, for me because uh, marathon is not easy. Uh, long time I was uh, running uh, 10,000, 10, 5,000 meters. So after that, I, I moved to marathon. Uh, even between, I had an uh, injury uh, for a long time. So after I recovered, uh, I came to marathon. Uh, still, I need time and, you know, time to learning uh, about marathon. Can you describe your sensation about Paris and Chicago marathons? Uh, for the Paris marathon, uh, of course, my first marathon, I was eager to run. I, I, I was motivated a lot uh, to run, you know, how to to see how it feels, you know, the, this uh, first marathon. Uh, of course, in the end, you know, I, I got good uh, results. Um, I'm, I'm happy about my result also. For the next marathon also, uh, I, make, I made a little bit, you know, uh, mistake uh, because uh, my training was not mm, going well. Uh, of course, I trained with a new coach. Uh, which uh, means, you know, he was not experienced about marathon. During my preparation, uh, the time I prepared was uh, uh, not enough time. Only I prepared like seven weeks, six, seven weeks, you know, preparing for Chicago. That's not enough for marathon. So that was uh, all my uh, fault and uh, my mistake. So maybe after, after this, you know, uh, I will uh, take care of myself, I will take care, you know, my program, everything to not do again, you know, mistakes over, that, over there. So I will take care of myself and, you know, keep, uh, uh, you know, follow a good trainer and a good training. So I hope, you know, I will, I will achieve in the future for the next marathon. I hope I will get a good result. Are you focusing only marathon now, or can we expect also a comeback to the track? Hundred uh, percent. Uh, I will not uh, look, you know, close the, the track running. Of course, maybe I want to join sometimes. Uh, of course, my big goal was uh, to success, you know, to uh, to be success in, uh, on marathon. So uh, maybe some percentage I will join you know also 10,000 maybe in the future so uh, I will see you know you are a big sports star now you got a lot of medals and records but are you still motivated for new challenges of course yes I, I all the time you know I have a big dream and you know I'm motivated uh, more in, you know uh, staying in confident of course, over 5,000, 10,000 10, meters, you know, I, uh, I'm holding uh, still a world record uh, more than, almost more than 10 years, you know, or, or very close to 10 years. Uh, till now, you know, nobody tried if, or even those records. So, you know, I'm happy and uh, I'm more confident, you know, about it and uh, of course, in the future also for the new challenging also I'm uh, I am more confident what does it mean running for you uh, you know running means you know my for me is my talent you know running is like anybody else you know the people who working you know in different job when they succeed that means that, that is their life you know they just for uh, their life, it's very important, you know, to survive, to uh, do something special in their job, in their uh, position. So uh, for me also the same thing, you know.
Shall we see you at the Olympic Marathon in Rio 2016? If God will hope, you know, uh, of course, uh, if God uh, help me, you know, with my healthy and, you know, time, why not? Of course, my goal was, my goal will be to run in Rio, you know, Rio Olympics. Uh, you know, to run for gold, whatever. So that's my big goal. Why not? Yeah.